this is socially triggered. And this video is going to be on how Google uh, disproves the whole climate change uh, narrative. And what I did is I, you know, whenever I hear these stories of mass extinctions and the world's going to end, I always just do a quick Google search. So the Google search that I did was uh, the number of species extinct per year. And basically that, that search pulls up all this number of species that have gone extinct. Now, you'll, you'll see that Google provides like what's called the answer box. And it says experts calculate that between 0.01 and 0.1% of all species will become extinct each year. If the low estimate of the number of species out there is true, that there are about 2 million different species on our planet. That means between 200 and 2,000 extinctions occur every year. So you're thinking, wow, 2,000 species going extinct. That's a big number. And you think, wow, that maybe they're right. Maybe, maybe the world is going to end. And you, you, all these thoughts might go through your head. Um, they actually go further than this. Um, if you actually read the, the article, I'm going to open up another tab here. Uh, if you read how many species we're losing, okay, okay, and they, they, they basically go into that whole narrative about, you know, uh, in here they actually say that there's 10, uh, 100 million different species on the earth, and the extinction rate is just 0.01 per year. So at least 10,000 species go extinct, and that's an even bigger number. So now we're like, wow, we're at a huge number of 10,000 species going extinct each year. So that's even crazier. Wow, you're thinking, wow, maybe, maybe the world is going to end. All the species are going to go extinct. So this is based on a big number of 100 million species. Okay, so let's go back to Google. <laughs> and um, let me show why Google itself disproves all of this. So underneath you'll see that uh, they actually you know they continue on with their answer box and then here how many species are extinct how many species have gone extinct in the last hundred years so you click on that just curious what what well nearly 500 species have gone extinct during the last century and in most cases we humans were to blame according to a 2015 study by the National Autonomous <laughs> University, uh, 477 species have disappeared since 1900 due to our uh, uh, destruction of natural habitats. Okay, so that's 500 species. So that's a much smaller number than 10,000 per year. So you'll notice that all of a sudden, this is this group actually. This university is actually considered the best university in Mexico. It's a Mexican university, but it's also one of the best top universities in the world. And they have a long history of looking at environmental issues, and they are experts in it. And they conclude that there's only been 500 species in the last hundred years. That's a far cry from 10,000 per year. So no, there isn't this mass dis, uh, extinction. But where does that 10,000 number come from? Well, there's an assumption that just through natural occurrences within our environment, that species will go extinct. Just, you know, they will either evolve or, or something will change, their environment will change, they just naturally go extinct. And it's happened in the past as well. So that's where the 10,000 number comes from. It's not that humans are causing all these animals to go extinct. It's that humans play a small role. About 500 species have died as a result of, well, they said 477 species have disappeared since 19, uh, 1900 due to humans. Um, well, that's a really small number. <laughs> when you're looking at, if, if you take this 10,000 stat, well, there, that means that there was roughly 1 million species that have gone extinct over the last 100 years. And that's based on uh, World Wildlife Foundation numbers. And of those 1 million, that's 477 that man might be directly related to. 
So <laughs> it's a really, really small number. So basically what they're saying is, no, <laughs> the species are not going extinct at any alarming rate. There's no mass extinctions. The world is not ending. Uh, it just naturally happens that some species will go extinct. Uh, there's not a mass, anything special. There's not a mass extinction going on. It's just a normal, everyday background noise of animals going extinct, and it happens. There's lots of species that we don't even know about. We're only aware of about 2 million species, and they figure there could be up to 100 million species. So really, a lot of the species that we uh, see going extinct we don't even see, <laughs> like we don't even know about. So um, this is how Google proves that um, this whole nonsense of mass extinctions, the world ending, is just all bogus. And it's not based on science. It's based on inflating the numbers, based on just picking numbers that really don't make sense. They're not. They're not using the real numbers. They're they're conflating that ten thousand number based on just a projection of how many species that there are. And the natural uh, extinction rates of those species, and then they're assuming that all of that is man-made. Well, that's not how it works. Uh, real scientists have shown that it's only been 477, or about five species, give or take, uh, per year. So it's really low number. And they figured actually in the last year it was only two. <laughs> so, um, so yeah. So the number number of species are not going down rapidly, and uh, man is not destroying the world as much as they would like you to believe. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I would like some feedback on it. And um, do you think man is destroying the world? Tell me. Thanks. Bye. Thanks for listening. Bye.